for joining us hello and thank you for inviting me terry mm. now since you took over the reins at the NAAU, there seems to be a, a more determined push to show your members in a more favorable light do you think the public's perception is so wrong Oh, absolutely. For decades now, the NAAU has been trying to make the public aware of a smear campaign brought against us by the media. They're trying to portray us as monsters. It's not fair and not based on facts in any way. For the last five years, our members have been required to register with the government and make their presence known to the local authorities in the interests of public safety. <laughs> now, I ask you, what other group in society has to go through this? Hmm. A good point. Now, at this stage, we're going to open up the lines for our listeners. Uh, first on the list, we have Paul of Mountain View. Paul, you're on the air. Hello? No, that's not the case at all. Well, my neighbor says they come around hassling for work all the time. You owe me a ride. You owe me a ride. Pick me up. Come get me. I'm a city hall. City hall. City hall. No. City. Are you high? City hall. Yeah. I'm at the front. I need a big dome thing. No, now. Thank you for those words, John. It's nice to see that there's some sensible people out there. It just goes to show how there is a growing percentage of the community that understands our plight and is willing to show support for our cause. Mm -hmm. Well, in that case, why aren't all humans vegetarians? How is it okay for you to say that one man can eat beef and not okay for another man to eat pork? It's hardly a fair comparison to what your kind like to eat. My kind? Sadly, that's all the time we have left for the evening. I'd like to thank all our callers for raising some interesting points. And a special thank you to Don August for doing such an admirable job on behalf of the NAAU. Yeah, this is Carl. Yep, just got on my break, man. Sorry. See you soon, though. Good job. Do you know your way out, or would you like me to buzz the front office? No, thanks. I know the way out. Thanks again.
from the National Association for Advancement of the Undead just so you could walk around and eat whatever random person you encountered on the street. Sorry. You better be sorry! You think it's hard being undead? Pull this stunt again and you'll see how hard to just be plain dead. Period. I feel a little 